Folks, greetings. I hope you are doing good during this COVID-19 situation. I am doing this voiceover, on behalf of Shanti Kumar V. He is three decades internationally experienced IT professional. He is an IT management practices consultant, mentor, coach and trainer for the working IT professionals to perform better on their jobs. Please search for his profile on Google. A continuation of my previous tutorials on Cloud Come DevOps coaching, now, let us see. Why are the containers so popular? Containers have the following features or properties. Lightweight. Speed. Portable. Security. Automation. Now let us see each of them in detail. What is lightweight of containers? 1. Containers are often compared to virtual machines. In this context, containers are much more lightweight than virtual machines. 2. A container can start up an isolated and secure runtime environment for your application in seconds, compared with the handful of minutes a typical virtual machine takes to start. Container images are also much smaller than their virtual machine counterparts. What is container speed? 1. Containers are fast, they can be downloaded and started within seconds, and within a few minutes you can test, build, and publish your Docker image for immediate download. 2. This allows organizations to innovate faster, which is critical in today's ever-increasing competitive landscape. How the container is portable? 1. Docker makes it easier than ever to run your applications on your local machine, in your data center, and in the public cloud. 2. Because, Docker packages are complete runtime environments for your application. They are complete with operating system dependencies and third-party packages. 3. The container hosts don't require any special prior setup or configuration specific to each individual application. All of these specific dependencies and requirements are self-contained within the Docker image. How the container is secured? 1. If the container is implemented correctly, the containers actually offer greater security than non-container alternative approaches. 2. The main reason for this is that containers express security context very well, applying security controls at the container level typically it represents the right level of context for those controls. 3. A lot of these security controls are provided by default, for example, namespaces are inherently a security mechanism in that they provide isolation. 4. A more explicit example is that they can apply SE Linux or AppArmor profiles on a per container basis, making it very easy to define different profiles depending on specific security requirements of each container. What is container automation? 1. The IT organizations are adopting software delivery practices such as continuous delivery, where automation is a fundamental requirement. 2. Docker natively supports automation. At its core, a Docker file is an automation specification of sorts that allows the Docker client to automatically build your containers. 3. And other Docker tools such as Docker Compose allow you express connected multi-container environments that you can automatically create and tear down in seconds. Folks, if you are keen in learning live similar cloud and DevOps projects related tasks for higher CTC, connect with Shanti Kumar V. Book a call by WhatsApp hash plus 9, 1, 888, 5, 0, 4, 6, 7, 9. To help you and to speed up your learning process and catch competent offers in the global IT job market. There were proven cases where we will explain them also before you join the coaching. Folks. Thanks for watching this video and we wish you with very good health and great IT career in future.